Hi everyone and welcome to my homestead allotment channel. Now it's a lovely day outside and I want to be cracking on with my parsnip bed but um, it's so hot in the greenhouse I've had to open a door and a window to get some air through um, and I've taken all the cloches off my seeds so I'll just give you a quick look at those. So I've got three of my brassicas are shot up now. My peas are all my peas are coming through. Got my celery and celeriac there. These are what I sowed the other week, so I'm not expecting these to come up yet. My uh, swede's starting to poke through. Some of my onions are starting to come through in here. It's my radish and my lettuce are doing really well, so happy with that. I've taken the cloches off just to get them to get a bit of air. My leeks haven't come through yet. Um, I think it's old seed, so I may have to uh, re sow those. Some potatoes there. Alright, today I want to be getting on with this parsnip bed here. I've got to put the decking boards round to join these two pieces together. Then I'm going to be removing this slab in here, digging down a bit, levelling it off, putting some cardboard down underneath the wood um, and a foot out from here and I'm going to cover that with wood chip when it arrives all the way around here so this will all be wood chips. So hopefully I won't, so that, that'll be enough of a barrier to stop the grass and the weeds from coming up in the bed. So I'm going to crack on with that now. Um, once that's done, I'm going to put horse manure in the bottom of it. I'm going to dig this carrot bed out, put that soil into this. And then I'm going to move that carrot bed where I need it down in here. And then... Uh, it will be sift, 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 sieving all of this lot into the two beds and probably having to go and pick up some more compost. After those two beds are done, I can then start cracking on with the rest of the allotment and maybe start getting ready to do the extension on the end of the beds, the five foot extension. So that's where we're at at the moment. I'm going to get on and do this hopefully. Seems it's a lovely day and nice and sunny. And uh, yeah, we'll see where we end up at the end of it. See you in a bit. Right, so uh, this is where I've got up to. I managed to join the two collars together um, and I've put a layer of cardboard down so I can cover that with wood chip when it turns up. See the cardboard goes on the inside a bit. I've put plastic all the way around on the inside to stop the wood from rotting or try to stop and I've folded it over on the bottom. I've also uh, moved some slabs so the path butts up against the raised bed. What I've got to do now is I'm going to put a layer of horse manure in the bottom so when the taproot of the parsnip drops down it has something to feed on um, but it will only be a couple of inches if that uh, layer on the bottom and then yeah two inches and then I'm going to fill it up with the sieved compost out of the carrot bed to start with and then I need to move the carrot bed 
and then so I've got some horse manure here and then the bags behind it um, are my, is my compost um, used compost so I'm gonna have to get on a marathon sieving and uh, fill them fill that bed back up and once that beds the carrot beds moved into here that, that's gonna have to be filled as well so uh, yeah that's where we're at at the moment so I'm gonna put a few bags of horse manure in there and uh, empty the carrot bed into it see you later right so I've put four bags of horse manure in here should probably tell you the size of the bed so it's three and a half foot by five foot and with the horse manure in it I've got 14 inches so just over a foot of uh, growing room for the uh, parsnips so I think that should be plenty but we'll see how it goes and I'm just gonna go and put the compost in from the um, carrot bed now so I'll uh, catch you in a bit hi everyone so I've managed to uh, fill this bed up it's probably less than halfway managed to move my carrot bed where I want it here is where I've dug out the carrot bed these are all stinging little roots and everything so that's all clear in there now I've got to get some cardboard um, so I can uh, start filling that up um, obviously I'm going to line the inside with some more plastic so what I, I wanted to uh, move it I've dug I've dug up here I've got to dig all of this out and then up the side of my greenhouse um, this is all going to be covered with uh, weed membrane so I get stinging nettles grow all the way along the fence here but yeah that's where we're at and quite a lot today I think so put all my seeds to bed so they should be okay I still think I'm gonna to have to re-sow those leeks but yeah just under halfway full I've got all these bags of compost I'm gonna to have to start sieving them and filling this bed up but well thanks for watching guys if you like my videos then please subscribe and like them and comment and I'll get back to you <clears throat> well that's it for today I'll see you in the next one thanks bye